homecoming fit for champions. I'm here at the Markham Pan Am Center where the town is saluting its local athletes who competed in Rio 2016. Let's give our Olympians a big warm welcome home. It was a hero's reception as hundreds welcomed and congratulated Olympic fencer Maxime brink Croteau, rugby official Rose Labreche, and triple Olympic medalist Andre de Grasse. De Grasse won a silver in the 100 meters, a bronze in the 400 meters, and a bronze in the 4x100 meter relay in Rio. To be able to have support from my city, you know, family, a lot of friends came out here that I grew up with, um, you know, it was just really incredible. I mean, <laughs> It was just, I just, I couldn't, I couldn't believe it. An emotional DeGrasse thanked his family and friends for their support, but it was his love and appreciation for his mom that stole the show. You know, just to have her there at the Olympic Games with me, it, it meant everything to me, you know. Um, so, I mean, that's all I can say. <laughs> And I was so speechless about it. I, I had no words for it. Um, so I was just so happy and you know so grateful. You know, I see how far I've come, and, and I'm just so happy I can share it, share it with them. The city of Markham also honored and surprised the sprinter with his very own street sign. Well, if uh, he doesn't know, he's loved in this community. I mean, look at. He's not finished. This guy's got tremendous potential to be able to pull off what he did at these Olympics to medal in the 100 and 200, something that hasn't been done since the late 1920s. And he's the only Canadian sprinter to have medaled in the 100, 200 and the 4x100 relay. He's in the history books. I believe in the power that comes. After the party in Markham, DeGrasse headed back to the U.S. where he's finishing his degree, but we'll be seeing more of this local superstar in the future. It's been pretty busy, um, you know, my life has, you know, gone upside down, um, you know, a lot of commitments, a lot of things that I need to do and get done, so I mean, I mean, it's a work in progress, um, you know, I'm happy, I'm looking forward to a lot of the things in the future, and, you know, I'm, I'm enjoying the moment, as you can say. And his advice to young fans? All I can say is really, you know, just continue to keep working hard, you know, have fun with what you do. As you can see, you know, I try to have as much fun as possible when I'm out there on the track. So, you know, you do those things, um, you know, good things will happen. And, um, you know, that's, that's, my, that's my key message to, those, to the kids. In Markham, I'm Julia Supa for Rogers TV.